pretty brutal. <laughs> it was like another one like last weekend, just pretty gnarly conditions. I thought it was going to maybe get a little better than it actually did and might have made wrong choice of the tyres. Ended up running with dry tyres, but it was a bit loose. <laughs> yeah, wake up and Groundhog Day, just do the same shit over again. It will be weird, but yeah, I don't know. It's a jam-packed four days. It's pretty... Uh, Pretty, there's not actually that much riding, but it's fuck stressful on the mind. I eh? just having to lay down a heater every day for four days in a row. <laughs> yeah, we've never done it before, so I'm just gonna wake up and to pretend it's quality day again. <laughs> forget, forget about the last couple of days, maybe. Yeah. Honestly, it was hectic. Like <laughs> yesterday, qualifying was uh, really good. Like there was a river running down the track, and it actually had grip, and then. Um, this morning it stopped raining around, you know, when the juniors were racing. So you couldn't just run wets, you know, like full wets because you'd just slide on the bike park stuff. But then you couldn't run dries because then it was, you know, losing time and all the deeper shit. So I elected to run dries. Um, yeah, it wasn't, I wouldn't say it was the worst hike and like combo, but it was, it was hard. But I, I don't know, honestly, like the, the boys that won today, like Loris is on another level in the mud. He just, I don't think there's any way I could ride that fast in these conditions. So big ups to him and um, on to tomorrow qualifying, mate. <laughs> yeah, like pretty much now on, it's not, it's not supposed to rain. So I'm hoping for the track to just dry out heaps because that's obviously where I excel. So um, yeah, pray for sun and wind and hopefully it dries out and go for the win on Sunday. Yeah, I guess it was it was okay. Um, not ideal, but still learning, still trying to figure a few things out. So just out there trying to have fun, and yeah, obviously not ideal today. Like my run was was okay, pretty good. I had a few good sections, but um, just found it really hard to push in these conditions. And I found it a little bit unpredictable, um, especially just the snipe route. So just you know, you think you could grip somewhere, you hit a root, and boom, boom you slip out or something. So. Um, it was just tricky, but I guess it's part of racing in Europe in winter, so we've got to get used to it. Two wet races in a week. Yeah, Friday race day. How was it? Uh, I crashed in the first turn, so it's not the not exactly how you want to start a race, but um, I, don't know, I just got back on and tried to get down, and I don't think I ended up like 34th or something. So just got a couple of points, and hopefully the next two days are, are good ones. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of nice to get straight back into it. Normally, if you have like a result, you're not not super happy about it. You have to wait at least five days, I guess, till you're on your bike again. So you got a lot of time to, to go over it and think about it. But I feel like I've kind of moved on already and just working on tomorrow.